Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert a portrait image to landscape in Filmora 11. Alright, so in my opinion, it is very easy to, to convert a portrait image to landscape in Filmora. By the way, now we have Filmora 11 and it seems to have some bug in the program uh, so that we cannot use the drop to fish function uh, to, to transform the image. So I'm going to show you another solution to uh, fix the problem. Okay, so let's go to my computer screen. Uh, all right, so now I'm inside Filmora 11, and the first thing we need an image. For example, this one. This is a portrait image. Uh, we are short in six, uh, in nine by sixteen. So I'm going to drag and drop it uh, onto the timeline. Okay. And as you can see that uh, yeah, the image is at the center of the screen and there are two black bar here uh, on the left side and on the right side. Uh, normally, all you need to do is to select the image or the timeline and then you can right click and select video and then you can select drop to fit. Uh, it will fix the issue. Uh, by the way, I'm, I'm going to uh, do it now so that you can see the bug in the program. Okay. Uh, drop to fit so nothing happened, right? And even. If we select the image and then go to the drop tools here and then uh, we can select the aspect ratio here uh, change it to 16 by 9 and then we can adjust the drop area uh, for example if I want to uh, drop to the face of the couple okay so at this point um, for example and then we can uh, click this button to, uh, to preview it okay but still nothing happened and the drop area area is just a uh, wrong place and this is a problem that I see in Filmora 11. Uh, by the way, I, I already reported this uh, this issue uh, to Wondershare support team, and they say that they will upgrade the software and fix the bugs soon. Okay, so let's uh, find another solution. Uh, let's click OK, and I'm going to delete the crop. Okay, delete the crop effect first. So in order to convert this portrait image to a landscape, we can use the zoom function uh, at the basic uh, feature, okay? So all we need to do is to select the image again and then you can right click and select edit properties, okay? Uh, so at the property, you need to select the image and then go to the basic and find the transform option right here. So you have a menu, transform menu, and then all you need to do is to scale up the image uh, like this, something like this. I can just uh, scale it up until it fit the screen. Okay, and I, I can even click on the image uh, at the preview window and then adjust the position. Alright, so for me, I think it's okay. By the way, you can adjust it uh, according to your need. Okay, and then you can click OK. Okay, so this is a solution for you to transform a portrait image to a landscape uh, in Filmora 11 and just uh, temporary. Uh, by the way, when they fix the problem, we can use the drop to fit function. Okay, so let's say uh, we have this image and now you want to use this image uh, at other position on the timeline. You can uh, just take a snapshot uh, of this image uh, to create a, a landscape one. Okay, so just use this one snapshot. Okay, so here is the landscape image that you have. Okay, so delete this one and now you can use it anywhere you want. Okay, it's a landscape, beautiful landscape. And you can also apply a zoom effect with the, the zoom and pan function. You can select the image and then click the crop function and then go to pan and zoom. And now you can just adjust the endpoint, for example, just to create a special zoom in effect. And remember to select the aspect ratio here also. And then we can play to preview it. Okay, and then we can click OK. And now we have a landscape image uh, with some zoom in effect. That's nice, right? So that is how to convert a portrait image uh, to landscape in Filmora 11. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. So if you have any problem with the software, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.